So if you do like a search on Amazon, you're going to see some really cool top gadgets. And I have them. And we're going to play around with them so you can see uh, a variety of them right here on the desk. Yeah, it's a mess. Let's just get to the first one here. This is from TC Tech. And it's so small that it's hard to find on the desk. This right here, this is it. This is a keychain that you can put on your keys. You can clip it uh, on your backpack or whatever. And it has a voice recorder on it. So this is going to be, it has 64 gigabytes built in and it charges with USB-C. And yeah, it's got a built-in voice recorder. And basically there's two different options here. So you have on, so it's just automatically recording. If we can uh, get this focus for you. Yeah, just like that. There we go. Uh, so you can do like on here. Why don't I just do a little zoom in here? That's even better. And you also have a, like a voice assist. So it will not record anything until it hears something like, like voices talking and stuff like that. So if you wanted to just kind of keep it on constantly and just recording and just like also recording over old stuff, um, that will work now to play back, you can plug it into your computer and get the files um off of this device but they also have this little usb c remote control that you can just plug in and then you can play back the audio you can change the different tracks turn up the volume um, it also comes with the little headphones as well uh nothing too impressive about the headphones and also nothing too impressive about the video quality this is not something that you're going to try to do a podcast with it is just going to be something if you need to record an important conversation Let's say yeah, you get in, get in the room with the boss and he's about to do some firing or something like that, but does it the wrong way. You can record him and gotcha or whatever. But yeah, it's very sleek, sleek and it's like quality build. It uh, doesn't seem flimsy or anything like that. So uh, yeah, there it is. It's really cool. Cool piece of tech. I mean, technically that could save you a lot of money in the end if you need to like have this voice recording. Like, nope, they said this. You know, that's a good, a good backup thing. So I do like the idea of having this on my keychain and if not necessarily to get someone, but, uh, you know, sometimes I have conversations where I can't remember what was said. Um, and it's nice to have that as a backup. So it's like someone's giving me instructions on like, Hey, we want you to film this video and we want you to do this and that and that. I'm like, uh, what? Yeah, this was all recorded. Let me jump ahead here because I want you guys to know what microphone I'm using and also what mic arm I'm using as well. So right now I'm actually using the IX Tech Cardioid mic. This thing right now, I've clicked on it. It is under $60. And this is what it sounds like going through XLR. If you, it has XLR. This will be a fun way to test this. I'll show you what it, what it does there. So if you look back there, it has um, headphone out so you can listen directly and it has um, USB-C and XLR. So if you just want to go through USB-C and use it like uh, to your computer, you can do that and it works great. It also gives you more options at the top where you can turn up and down the volume um, and mute the mic as well. There's this little foam cover for it as well. So if you don't want the foam cover, but you know, this might be a little bit harsh. I don't have the headphones in, so I can't hear it, but pop that thing back on and it looks really nice. It looks really sleek. I do like that design. And, um, yeah, this pairs really nicely with the arm. Yeah. So that's the IX tech and the boom arm. If you're looking for something that is not gonna, not gonna kill you in the, in the wallet, but also uh, something that's going to sound like this. I mean, why not? All right, moving on to some other gadgets here. Uh, we're going to get to some trickier ones. So this is the Evil Eye 36X times zoom telephoto lens for your smartphone. Now, this is going to be a bit tricky to kind of just show you how exactly how it works, but we'll we'll try. We'll try here. But here's here's what it is. Let's go ahead and flip that there and uh, come in a little bit. So it comes in this nice little case, but look at how big this thing is. It's like a periscope in the pirate days, right? Um, but it works. It really does work and it looks really good. So it's got like a cap for it and it's got a, another cap in the back. And the way it's going to work is it comes with this 
custom phone mount. And it also comes with a, a little tripod as well, but you can put it on any tripod because it's got the quarter thread. Um, and it's also got a cold shoe on the top, which is nice. But the way it's gonna work is this part right here moves up and down and you're gonna put your phone on. This is the actual tripod that it comes with, with a little ball head on top. So just so you can see how it, how it lines up there. Okay, so we're gonna put this on. Let's see if uh, this does a better job showing you. Okay, you can see that now, look at that. So let's go to the, t the TV that's behind me, whoa. So there's a, a bit of a focus you could do. Look at that. That is crazy. Look at that. Ah, that's look at this big thing. So you can uh, you can use that and really really utilize that. That's like uh, you know to to film whatever you want to film. I love that. That's so fun. Um, so if you're out in nature, you know. Yeah, so there we go. That's the 36 times zoom lens. I mean, there's there's some uses for it, uh, especially if you live in the city, or you know, if you're out in nature and you want to see get you know get your video out and get a closer shot of that. Maybe you have you don't have a phone that has a 10 times zoom or 36 times zoom. If you have a three times zoom, this 36 becomes three times 36. Yes, do the math yourself. The next one we're going to go into um, is the Ranvu fan. So here we go. This is a a little, to me, it's like a pocket-sized fan, but it really packs a punch. It comes with this little strap that you could put around it. I mean, you can use any strap if you want, but um, it is detachable as well. So you can squeeze this and pull it out um, when it's easy, easier when it's around your neck versus how I'm holding it. So you have the power button and you can feel it immediately. Let's just go here. So you can watch my face as the fan hits. It's a it's a cool air too. It like brings in the normal air and it just cools it down as well. So here's two. Ooh, that feels good. Here's three. So you can see it's got the fans right there and it brings in the outtake from there. So you wear it around. You know, you're at an amusement park or something like that. It's pretty hot out there. You're in a long line. You can just have this just chilling, pick it up, uh, cool down. You know, maybe you'd want to pop this thing off really quick. It's a very interesting design of, I like also, yeah, this swivels around, so it's not too weird, but yeah, pop it off like that. And then uh, I don't really know what the point is for that. Because, I mean, really if you think about it. You didn't want to wear it. You just take it off. Because if you take this off, what are you? What are you gonna do? Unless you had it like, I guess, wrapped around. I don't know. I don't know. This next one is actually one of the things that uh, I do a lot is film with my phone. But one of the things I don't like is when. You get reflections like if you're filming something with reflections and it just shows that you're using your phone so i have this thing it's um from emily in paris i think there's a tv show where she some emily person used this so that's what it's from but it's awesome there was a little thing here that fell off um i had this in vegas and i had them in my bag and i think that the other one fell off first, but I glued it on and it was fine. And then this one fell off and I don't know where that went. So um, other than that, I might just get some, anything black that would go there, fill it in. But you can see how this is going to look. I love that it's got a non-functional cold shoe. Like I'm, that's way too small for normal cold shoes. But so these are all just fake buttons and things like that. Um, and <clears throat> so if I was to put this on my phone, I'm doing, I'm going live tomorrow sometime with some clothes reviews. Ah, cool. Well, let us know when that happens or I'll just, I think there's a way now. I just saw that you can, uh, get live notifications. So under the thing, you can say live notifications. Now I use this on my trip to Las Vegas because 
I was, you know, on a, a skateboard. I was doing a big like e-skate thing. And one of the coolest things was just having this around your neck, right? And you can make that a little bit tighter if you did, if you wanted to. Can you? Yeah, sorry, there it is. Way down there. And these are clips that can be unclipped. Um, so like that looks that looks rad. But like I was just like skateboarding, and then every time I would want to get a shot, like I could just get that up, like and get the shot, like whoops, like that, you know, get the quick shot. Um, if, if it was more loose, it's easier, but then that way I can just set it down and not have to be like fumbling around for my pocket. So to me, like something like this would even be great just for traveling. Uh, when you want to get those quick shots, you don't want to put the phone in your pocket and pull out all of your money on accident or anything that you have in there because you're pulling your phone out all the time. So that is actually, that is pretty cool. You're saying you're not talking about the fan, right? Um, yeah, it is really cool. Like, so now if I'm filming something with my phone, you know, and it just kind of shows up a little bit, it looks like I'm using a really, like a really cool camera. So people would be like, whoa, what is that thing that you're, you're filming on? It's like my secret. All right, let's move on to the next one here. So this one is called the Mag Snap Magnetic Wrist Strap or Wrap It. Remember the snap bracelets you have? So like that if you're doing like any home projects or construction or something like that this is great because you know you usually have a bunch of have a bunch of screws in your hand so there you go so you have a bunch of screws or nails and you don't want to put them in your pocket yeah that that's how that works um which you know you're, you've um you've done this before where you've had like had to hold this on your tube because you don't want to dangerous right this is a great way to uh yeah just keep it magnetically around your wrist there's also a little pocket here so you could put something in there if you need to but uh i do yeah Ooh, it's a little bit a little bit heavier than your normal one but um yeah so that's gonna be uh great for you so there we go that's the uh rabbit i mean it's great quality it has good stitching um it's Heavy, it's heavy duty for construction or just that home project thing. So, so we got a few more things to get to here. We got the laser pointer. So if you type in uh, top gadgets on uh, Amazon, this is a laser pointer that they showcase. And when you get it, you're kind of like, okay, cool. Uh, that's some, some cool designs. Yeah, sure. So you just spin it around. It's like, ooh, ah. And it goes pretty far for this, but uh, there's more to it. This part right here actually comes off. And now you actually have a solid laser. And like, this is the laser that goes, like it is very bright and it goes very far. We were out in the desert. We were shooting this thing on like mountains. It was so crazy how strong this thing is. But uh, yeah, if you wanted to add the, the cool effects, you pop that thing on and now you have yeah, you could spin it just like that. And actually, like when it's dark and you have it on the ceiling or something like that, it's really, really cool to watch. Um, and then on the other side of that, first of all, there's a wrist strap. And on the other side, it is USB. I'm going to put these lights back on. But it's, uh, it's USB. So this is how you charge it. You plug it into like a regular USB port. It just sticks out like that. And uh, which is kind of weird. If you think about it, like most of them have it the other way. So you plug the USB into that, but they went, no, oh, we want you to plug this into your computer or plug this into the, the wall USB and let it stick out. So it is, it does feel nicely made. It doesn't feel cheap. It feels good quality. And uh, this is another keychain thing that you can use. Uh, just like if you need, if you need a quick screw in your life, <clears throat> you know, a lot of times you find yourself going out, oh man, where's my Phillips head? Where's my you know, flathead just for something really quick. And these are great, to, I mean, for seven bucks, these are great to, uh, and good quality too. They're not like the ones that you like will strip out when you use it one time. I've used these on uh, several occasions and they've been like very, very handy. So having them on your keys, uh, just, just in case. And uh, you would be surprised how many times you're like, Oh yeah, I can use those. I have that with me. Uh, yeah, there's like tool, like multi tools and stuff that you can get, but for some reason I like these a little bit better just because if you can see how like 
<clears throat> how it's designed, you get a little bit more leverage, right? When you're holding it like that versus like some other ones that are multi-tool and bulky and annoying. So that's kind of nice. Endoscope here. So we're going to jump into this one right here. This is um, endoscope. What this is, is you have a tiny little camera on this long cable. And definitely a lot of that cable is very um, easy to contort. So you can kind of bend it certain ways. <clears throat> so you have a camera with a light. And then on the other side, it goes to lightning or USB-C and you plug it into your phone and uh, it opens up an app, free app. And then you can use that to see what you need to see. And then also has a light on it on the camera. There's a light in there. So you, if you're in a dark place, you can adjust the brightness of it and stuff like that with this. And it works. I'll show you in a second, but uh, it also comes with these attachments. I knew someone was going to say something about colon. <laughs> There's these attachments right here. So this one right here is a magnetic one. So like, let's say you drop a screw or something that down the wall, you can, <clears throat> un you can take this part out. You can screw on this attachment and you can go in and get, you know, stick it to it. Then there's one that's a hook. So if you need to like go through and grab a wire or something like that, you can hook that wire on. And then there's like a little periscope one where you can set it there and you can get to a spot. If it's like a complete like right angle and you can't go any further, you can use that to see what's over there. So that is nice. If you're going into like a wall or like maybe you're a mechanic and you need to get into a spot in like the car. So I'm going to, Go ahead and then pop this thing. You see, it's like really nice. It's a quality, it's quality cable. Let's see if that, that holds. Can you see this? There we go. So this is the, the camera. As you can see, there's me. And like, here's, you can also with this on the app, you can flip the image as well. And I think you can flip it the other way too. There we go. So if you're looking for something, now we'll turn the light on. Uh, yeah, wow, you can really, you can really get in there. Um, <clears throat> so that's that's the what it looks like with the light on, and you can adjust the brightness of it. But uh, it's actually not bad. If I was to show you down here, this is a Mac Mini. So there you go. That's uh, that's what it looks like. You can record the video as well and take photos. So let me, the camera is shockingly good quality. I know it is, right? Like the same. We were like, whoa, that actually looks good. Yeah, so you can record the video. <clears throat> that way if you needed, you know, if someone was like, hey, what's wrong or what's that thing? What are the, if like someone needed to see proof of something, I don't know, uh, you can get the, the, the picture um, and video. Like you can take photos as well as videos. Um, you know, maybe you see a snake and you want to capture it. So really good quality cord. Um, I saw this. Yeah, it's a top gadget. Um, I love that it's lightning and USB-C and comes with all those attachments, which is great. So, so this was another one that was very interesting. This right here is a resealer for like bags. This right here, it takes batteries. It's magnetic. And to turn it on, you just have to bring this down this way and it starts heating up this bit right here so you can see that heats up and then you're gonna like it's gonna like make a something hot so it's gonna basically reseal it with heat um and it works so magnetic which is great because you can put it on your refrigerator and so if this is the bag right here see it's open <clears throat> but we want to let's say we want to seal it here why you'd want to do that? Probably not with this bag. I don't know. Just for example. So what you do is you go into the middle of it and then you press and then you just move it across. You don't need to hold it too long. If you hold it too long, uh, you'll singe right through it and then you'll flip it over and go the other way. And kind of a bad, bad job, but you get, you get the idea. Cause look, 
the bag is sealed right there. And then you can easily open it back up. Well, not maybe not easily, but yeah, in some level. <laughs> no, I see. I just there you go. It's it's actually completely sealed. That's amazing. So like if you have like chips or something you don't want it to go stale, um, you could use this bag and and easily do that. Also, what's cool about it is it has a little knife, a little uh, you know box opener or package opener thing. Like if you do have chips or something you don't want to use your fingers, you can slice that open. <clears throat> really cool product. I didn't even know something like this existed, and I saw that and I was like, I gotta try that. And the first time I ever did that with a bag, I was like. What? That is crazy. Um, this is the Music Cozy Sleep Mask. I got this <clears throat> because it looks great. Did some long flights um, from, you know, Australia to America. It's 14 hour flights and you want some sleep. I, I will say it's got, uh, let me tell you some of the features first. It's got Bluetooth, connects right to your phone and you can start and stop um, music, change tracks, change the volume. <clears throat> excuse me and uh, it has a microphone as well so you can even take calls so if you're like in the middle of like a, a sleep and someone's calling you you can press the button and be like what's up stop bothering me while i'm sleeping and uh so you can do that it's, you don't have to use it in the bed or at night you can use it if you just want to take a nap or just relax um and because there's little speakers built into the sides here you can like play some relaxing music or something that you want and <clears throat> this is the kicker to me is this part right here. So I've used masks before, but this makes it feel like you're not wearing a mask. Like nothing's pressed up against your eyes. You can actually just close your eyes and relax. Like other masks, you know, you just, they, they, you feel it on your face. This makes it feel like it's so soft. And then just the cutouts just make it so perfect for your eyes on the flight back, uh, on the flight, the long flight, um, from, Vancouver to Brisbane. Yeah, I used this thing and it was amazing. Like every, everything was out. Like I will say on a flight though, the speakers are not loud enough. It's not like um, you need some in-ear stuff when you're on a, a long flight because of the, the loud plane noise. Uh, you can still hear the music, but it's not, um, but it wasn't like blocking out that sound. So it's Velcroed in the back, it's easy. And like I said, it, <laughs> It blocks everything out, but it doesn't like, it doesn't like get in the way. Like I have my eyes open and it's just dark. So that is a good thing. Cause like sometimes you want to open your eyes with regular masks. Like you feel that it just, it's hard. So that is really comfortable. And man, I, I could just take a nap right now, to be honest, that feels so good. Ah, yeah. So you can, uh, listen to music, play some soothing music or whatever, take calls with your eyes blocked out to everything and just relax. That's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching and uh, hopefully you enjoy that. And if you did, again, leave a follow and um, hit that heart and, and uh, whew, see you next time. <laughs>